Okay, here's your McQueen robot here. Um, so, first thing to check is make sure that the battery slot there is pushed in all the way. Oh, it's just that one there, some of them fall loose. So once you've done that, um, to program it up, you to get your micro bit. You should be, should be fairly familiar with that now. Make sure the screen is at the front. And put it into the slot like this. Push down. Um, the on and off button is at the back there. Okay, so that's currently off. Um, and to connect it up, same as we always did. You can take the micro bit out and then plug it in later if you want. Or just, uh, which is probably the easiest way actually. So if you take that out, you just plug it in like you usually would. First command we're going to use, we're going to find on the McLean tab here. And we're going to use motor M1. So just drag that out. I'm just going to do it inside the um, on start. And basically um, the options here, are, uh, we can choose which motor we wish to control. So M1, M2 or all. So left, right or both. Um, direction, clockwise or counterclockwise. Um, basically clockwise is forward, counterclockwise is back. And this is the speed. If you click on that, you can go anywhere. You can type a number if you want, or you can drag this anywhere between zero and two five five. So I'll just drag it up to two five five. Um, I'll just do for now both. I'll do separately. So I'll duplicate that, put it down there, and I'm going to make that M two. So it's going to make both motors go clockwise at a speed of two five five. Uh, I'll get rid of that block, and I'll save that command. Once I've done that, I will drag it to into here, and the screen will come up. Once that finishes uh, copying across, now that we've finished copying it across, I'm just going to unplug the micro bit and push it into the McQueen once again we want this screen towards the front push it in nice and firmly and I'll put it on the ground and I will turn it on and there it goes